Samsung's next big thing in the foldable phone market. We're talking about the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim or Ultra, Samsung's upcoming premium foldable that's generating a lot of buzz. This phone has just been certified in South Korea, and it looks like it's closer than ever to being officially introduced. So let's dive into what we know so far about this sleek and ultra-thin device that might just redefine what we expect from foldable smartphones. First things first, let's talk about that certification. The Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim, also possibly known as the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, was recently spotted on South Korea's Safety Korea certification site. The device identified by the model number SMF958N and an internal codename Key6A has taken a major step toward its rumored late September release. All signs point to September 25th as the date Samsung might officially unveil this premium foldable. However, it's important to note that this model might have a limited release, possibly only being available in South Korea and China. In China, the device might even go by a different name, the Samsung Galaxy Dolly 25. Now onto the standout feature of this device, its thickness, or rather, its lack of it. Samsung is reportedly making the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim Slash Ultra the thinnest foldable they've ever produced. So, just how thin are we talking? Compared to the 12.1 million years thickness of the regular Galaxy Z Fold 6, the Slim Slash Ultra model is rumored to be just 10 million years thick when folded. That's a significant reduction in thickness, especially for a foldable device. To achieve this level of thinness, Samsung made some strategic decisions. They removed the silo for the S Pen, which might be a bummer for those who love the convenience of storing their S Pen directly in the phone. Additionally, they removed the 0.3 mm digitizer layer on the screen that supports the S Pen. These changes allowed Samsung to shave off those extra millimeters, making the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim Slash Ultra even more compact. An insider from the wireless industry provided some interesting insights, saying that Samsung is pulling out all the stops to make this device as thin as possible. The global smartphone market is increasingly focusing on how thin the next generation of devices can be, and Samsung seems to be at the forefront of this trend. The company likely collaborated with its own subsidiaries like Samsung Displays and Samsung Electromechanics to develop thinner foldable displays and more compact camera components. Even though the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim Slash Ultra is thinner, Samsung hasn't compromised on the screen sides. In fact, it's rumored that this model might feature a larger 8-inch internal screen compared to the 7.6-inch display on the regular Galaxy Z Fold 6. The cover screen is also expected to see a slight increase from 6.3 inches to 6.5 inches. These upgrades could provide users with even more screen real estate while maintaining the device's slim profile. As for the cameras, there are a few changes on the horizon. The under-display camera is expected to get a small bump in resolution from 4 megapixels to 5 megapixels. While that might not seem like a huge upgrade, every little bit helps when it comes to improving image quality. The front of what we expect from foldable smartphones. With its ultra-thin design, larger screens, and refined camera setup, this device could be a game-changer for Samsung and the foldable phone market as a whole. What are your thoughts on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim Slash Ultra? Are you excited about the possibility of an even thinner foldable? Let me know in the comments section below. As always, see you in the next video. And we've got some exciting news about Samsung's upcoming foldable smartphones. If you're a tech enthusiast, you're definitely going to want to stick around for this one. We're talking about the highly anticipated Galaxy Z Fold 6 series, and more specifically, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, which is rumored to be coming to China and Korea. Let's dive right in. Among the many Galaxy Z Fold 6 models that are currently in development in Samsung's labs, the one that has everyone buzzing is the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Now, if you're familiar with Samsung's ultra-branded smartphones, you know they are designed to be the best of the best, offering high-end features and cutting-edge technology. While the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 is expected to bring some minor incremental upgrades, all eyes are undoubtedly on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. However, here's the catch. The Ultra isn't expected to get a global release. But don't worry, it seems this powerhouse of a device won't be restricted to just Samsung's home country, South Korea. According to the folks over at Android Headlines, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra could also be launching in China. This is particularly interesting because it seems the rumored Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim which we've been hearing about with its slimmer body, bigger displays, and larger battery, might actually be the Chinese variant of the Fold 6 Ultra. If this is true, it would clear up some of the confusion we've seen in recent weeks about how many models Samsung is actually working on. It might just be two. The Galaxy Z Fold 6 and the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra, the Ultra, limited to Korea and China for now, would allow Samsung to gauge interest levels before potentially bringing it to a wider audience. 
In China, the Z Fold 6 Ultra may be sold as the Samsung Go 25 complete with unique visual touches like decorative engravings on the hinge, similar to previous Samsung Gilly smartphones. And here's another interesting tidbit. China might also get the Galaxy Z Flip 6 as the W25 Flip. This is speculative at this point, but it aligns with rumors that Samsung is also working on a Galaxy Z Flip 6 Slim. Now, unfortunately, there isn't a lot of detailed information about what exactly the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra will offer compared to the Z Fold 6, this is probably because the Ultra model isn't launching alongside the standard model, but we can expect more details to emerge once the standard Galaxy Z Fold 6 goes official at Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked event next month. Samsung's Galaxy Unpacked events are always full of surprises and we can't wait to see what they have in store for us this time. Will the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra live up to the hype? Will it bring groundbreaking features that set apart from the standard model? Only time will tell. To be an upgrade. While rumors suggest a larger display and a slimmer design, the lack of S Pen support might be a deal breaker for some users. Ross Yanon also mentioned that production for the Z Fold 6 Ultra's display panels might begin later this year, with a launch expected in January alongside the Galaxy S25. This staggered release makes sense. It avoids competing with the July launch of the regular Fold 6 and keeps the Ultra exclusive to South Korea for now, which might frustrate international buyers. Speaking of launches, rumors suggest the next Galaxy Unpacked event might be happening on July 10th in Paris, France. However, Tipster E-Leak's list of expected reveals didn't include the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra. Does this mean no Fold 6 Ultra this year? Probably not. E-Leak's list might only include devices long leaked photo a few days ago, looks a bit cheap and out of place on a flagship smartphone expected to cost over $1,500. The device in the picture also appears to be wider than the current Galaxy Z Fold models, suggesting that Samsung is increasing the display size. However, the screens won't be significantly bigger. Samsung is reportedly saving the major display size upgrade for the Galaxy Z Fold 6 Ultra and Galaxy Z Fold 6 Slim models, which are rumored to launch alongside the standard Z Fold 6 this year. Now, let's move to the front. The first hands-on image of the Galaxy Z Fold 6 has leaked and reveals that Samsung has finally listened to Galaxy Z Fold users. The new foldable phone will feature a wider cover screen compared to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. Reliable tipster Ice Universe shared this full image showing the front of the device and comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. As you can see, the upcoming foldable phone will have a wider cover screen that matches the width of the Galaxy Z Fold 5's cover screen plus one of its bezels. This wider cover screen should improve the typing experience on the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and resolve aspect ratio issues in some apps and games. The new foldable also appears to have much sharper corners for both the body and the cover screen. A tipster shared a photo that seems to show a new camera module for the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. Although the leak only indicates that the camera module will feature a new design, it's doubtful Samsung would implement a design change without also upgrading the camera hardware. Here we have the first look at the new Galaxy Z Fold 6 outer display. A Twitter user named Ali recently shared a render comparing it to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. According to Ali, the new outer display features a boxier design and a slimmer hinge, significantly enhancing a Fold 6's overall appearance. The most noticeable difference between the Fold 5 and Fold 6 is the wider cover display. The render clearly shows what do you think about these changes? Are you excited about the wider cover screen and new design? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with all the latest tech news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.